the 32 bonus 32 red dot com made and his next then this is a mile and a half for four year olds and upwards the top one is Flopalopagus Hands Grinky Jamie Hopkins King Mufasa Schlegito Prince Rules Obi Wan Spiders Web Graham Clutterbuck Audacious Gesture Mazad Mystery Jane Austen David Robertson Larwood Muzz Doug Warren, Layla, SM Fisher, Queen Fisher, Drew, Derek Hinton, and a street dancer, Alex Cherry. So just 11 then this time. And away they go. And the first one to show looks like being Flopalopagus, which is always a good, good one to say. That rolls off the tongue quite nicely. Grinky's also making a forward move now. With the trainer of that, it's a baseball fan. Uh, Grinky's a pretty good uh, pitcher. And Grinky is the leader then. Well, he's now been overtaken by Prince Rules. Um, Prince Rules is now the leader from Grinky, then Flopalopagus, Jane Austen's after that one. And then Queen Fisher Drew. And the back marker early on is Audacious Gesture. But they've sorted themselves out then through the first couple of furlongs. And Grinky is the leader from Prince Rules in second. Layla is third, then Queen Fisher Drew is fourth. And Flopalopagus has dropped back to fifth. Lord Miss is making a forward move. And um, behind them, Jane Austen and King Mufasa. Spider's Web and Audacious Jester are just the back two at this stage. But they've still got a little over a mile to race. And Grinky is the clear leader. From Prince Rules and Flopalopagus. And Lord Miss making a forward move. Layla's also close to the four. One or two new trainers this season in this race. Good to see. And one or two returners as well. Grinky, though, the leader from Larwood Muzz in second then comes Flopalopagus then Layla's after that one Prince Rules and Street Dancer Queen Fisher Drew King Mufasa and Jane Austen after that one with Audacious Gesture and Spider's Web still the back marker for Graham Clutterbuck but Grinky is the leader from Flopalopagus then comes Larwood Miss and Prince Rules Jane Austen trying to get a little bit closer as well as they come down past the five furlong mark and Grinky's had it pretty much his own way in the lead up so far, but Jane Austen looks like she's coming to write a new chapter in second with Flopalopagus third, then Lowell misses after that one, Prince Rules and Spiders Web, Queen Fisher Drew, and then Layla, who can't quite get the right note today. Then comes King Mufasa and Street Dancer is the back marker. But it's Grinky in the lead by half a length through Jane Austen in second. Gap back to Flopalopagus and Lowell miss. Then comes Prince Rules and Spiders Web, Audacious Gestures now making a forward move. Street Dancer and Layla and King Mufasa are still towards the back but Grinky is now being challenged by Jane Austen, Larwood Miz and Flopalopagus are closing behind in second, third and fourth and then comes Queen Fisher Drew, Spiders Web, Audacious Gestures one has petered out pretty quickly but now Jane Austen hits the front and Jane Austen's the leader from Grinky Larwood Miz running on in third, Flopalopagus four and then Queen Fisher Drew there inside the final furlong now and this one looks like it's going to go to Jane Austen, Jane Austen is pulling away and Jane Austen is going to write a great story here up towards the line Jane Austen writes a new chapter of SO6 and wins it, Flopalopagus with second, Queen Fisher Drew after that one, then Lowell Muzz and Spider's Web. And a comfortable, easy win for Jane Austen and David Robertson. Flopalopagus for hands was second. Queen Fisher Drew, Derek Hinton third, and Lowell Muzz for fourth.